on site. That is where the problem is. Talk to me about the legal advice, because yes. we have an attorney general mm -hmm. who advises the government when it comes to certain policies they want to uh, implement. Yeah. When we take a look at the issues that we've seen the court sort of put a stop on, uh, when it comes to Haiti, it put a pause on uh, this issue on uh, payment of fee for national schools on e-citizen, they put a pose on that. Housing levy. Yeah, housing levy, yeah. you name it. <coughs> Is it yeah. lack of advice? How would you put it? No, I don't know what's <laughs> happening between <laughs> within the Attorney General and the President. But you know, even in the previous time, we had uh, the Attorney General then uh, not agreeing with the Head of State, mm -hmm. or rather the Head of State not taking the Attorney General's uh, advice seriously. It is a very bad precedent because like I said, this being a civilized nation, you should allow every person to play the responsibilities within his desk. Mm -hmm. And you should always ask for the reports and honest advice about any particular step. You can't tell a doctor that I want you to prescribe this medicine because this is the one I like. If he does that, then you are going to die. So even in law, you cannot tell a whole attorney general to find out how he can legalize what you have in your mind. You must ask him for a honest opinion. What if we take this direction? Then the AG should tell you it may not work. Okay, fine. Then what if we take this direction? Now that's what is consultation. So I, I, I am not sure that uh, the Attorney General, I can't speak for him though, that uh, he is giving the exact you know, correct advice mm -hmm. and that the President is taking it or he's not taking it. Okay. The point here should be, that that is what should be emphasized. The Attorney General must be given ample time to give his opinion according to his law school knowledge. Okay. Then he has to leave it at that because you can't force your client to take your advice, but you can give him your advice. Okay. So I think the issue could be the men and women. You know, you've seen the president surrounds himself with people who say, I am an engineer, I do this. You know, if you go that direction, Honestly, the country will take a longer time to recover. I think that every good professional, you've seen it D himself sometimes complaining that things are not working. Mm -hmm. Why are they not working? Okay. This is one of the exceptional economies we have in the country. So I think that every professional around the head of state should be nurtured well by the head of state himself and should be allowed to give his opinion without influencing his opinion. Okay. That is the only way the country can move forward, yes. Okay, and still on this.